why they call it the uh, prop shop. A lot of mess in here. A lot of old new sets. A lot of things. Just that. Oh, and this is uh, these are have, this has to do with all of our satellite hookups to the network and our dishes out front. Bye, Rob. Aren't you? Isn't he, he's already gone. What a butthead. He took off. Didn't even have a party. Didn't even say goodbye. All he did was work. He didn't even want this video. We have to he didn't even want this video. <laughs> I hope you're having a good time in Tampa, though. Rob's been gone for a month now. Who's Rob? We still gotta say bye to him. Bye, Rob. Is that all you gotta say? Hey, I barely knew the guy. I mean, I'm only, I'm only kidding. Uh, Rob, we do miss you. Um, and all that. But got some good news. I'm a short timer now. Hey, I'm out of here in, sometime in October, going to Gainesville. And uh, I'm looking forward to it. And I hope everything is working out for you. When you left, like, you know, the creative juices just stopped flowing for a while, and we're still trying to regroup from all that, so for me, I'm not going to have anything very creative, I guess, but I miss you, and hope everything's well in Tampa, and I hope to come down and see you soon, so take care, and remember, we miss you very much. Take care. Don't work too hard. We, uh, where we are right now is the uh, satellite room, or actually the... I'm not exactly sure where this is, but it's pretty, some pretty neat stuff in here. This is another room with a lot of electronic junk in it. It has to do with uh, our satellite hookups to the rest of the world. Interesting room, huh? We rarely come back here, usually because it's so hot. What you're looking at now is, I don't know what it is. And we go, now we're going to go into here. I believe this is engineering room. No, this is, this is a closet. <laughs> well, it's another... A lot of lots of noisy machines in here. This one's locked, so it must be important. This is the engineering room. Rob Schweitzer. It's really quiet, qualified, uh, efficient worker. The kind of guy who you least expect to be hiding mini Mac 40s under his seat, which would be pulled out at the right moment to blast away the entire production department. And anybody else who happened to be in the way. But that's exactly the kind of person that Rob Schweitzer is. Quiet, unassuming. I can hear the sound by right now. He seemed like a nice guy. <laughs> I didn't think he had to do something like that. <laughs> but we all know the truth. Just as long as you do it in Tampa, not here. Oh. <laughs> Goodbye, Rob. We really miss you. Lorraine says she has nobody competent in the production department now. <laughs> I, should add, I should add a legitimate angle and get down on Rob Schweitzer because he was a very pleasant guy to work in, with in this newsroom. Level-headed, pleasant as can be for attractive. some strange... Attractive. attractive. The lady says attractive. Attractive. All the girls thought he was attractive. So, that about wraps it up. Damn good qualifications. <laughs> really? Yeah. Hey, Rob, buddy, we missed you. We know you're in Tampa checking out, having a lot of fun and checking out the buns and all that kind of good stuff. Have a good time, and we'll really miss you, man. Bye-bye. Tony Brown, you don't know me, but... Uh... This is the, where the engineers do their voodoo that they do so well. Okay, now we're coming out of this. Have you gotten a good look at this place? It's worth looking at, you know. There's a, there's a new camera around here somewhere, but uh, I guess we won't bother with that. It's probably created, created up and on its way out. Okay, this is uh, coming out of the engineering room into the tape room, where this is the domain of Scott Young. These are all of our three-quarter inch tape, tape machines here, and Scott's probably the best tape operator we have here. Yes, that's so. true, that's true. <laughs> That's where that's where Dave does all of his magic. Uh, Dave Roberts is operating the camera. That's the production uh, production editing bay, and these are the machines we use during the newscast. This is a three-quarter. Uh, excuse me. This is a two-inch machine. This is also a two-inch machine. These are these are dinosaurs, like most of our equipment here. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, I'm Mr. Schweitzer. He does. Uh, can you tell me what these are over here, please? <laughs> no, these are uh, beta machines, and that's where we run most of our commercials on off of. And uh, a lot of other programs. Scott's over here loading up a one-inch machine. That's state-of-the-art as far as I'm concerned. I think betas have a pretty poor quality, but one-inch is still state-of-the-art in my mind. And uh, these are monitors and other things and lots of neat stuff. Maybe, uh, I don't know, maybe not. Maybe I'm crazy for thinking so, but, you know, 
I'm depressed most of the time, and it's just Christmas. I think Christmas, those few weeks around Christmas, that make me feel, feel happy. And I just wish everyone else could feel the way I do. That's all. Oh, and by the way, Merry Christmas. This is Good Morning Jacksonville News. Good morning, everybody. I'm Mike Moore. In the news at this hour is this clown. He is Robert Schweitzer. Rumors have now been confirmed Rob is leaving Jacksonville for the sun in front of Tampa, Florida. All of his friends here at Television 12, including Harold, Lou, Rick, and Scott, wish him the very best of luck. And Rob, if it doesn't work out, there's always Ringling Brothers' Barnum Bailey Circus. We'll have further developments on these stories and more at 11. This place. So you'll so you either say goodbye or... Or we'll have an hour and 20 minutes and you just sit there looking silly. <laughs> we'll just sit there cut it. No, not yet. These are all on beta things. Just for instance, here's a uh, uh, Coca-Cola Diet Coke commercial. Right here. Actually, this is uh, this is a tape room, <laughs> or is a tape room the, the film room, the shipping room? I'm not sure. Thanks. Hi, Rob. You're a great employer. <laughs> <laughs> this is engineering. This is where we control our satellite ho hookups and our uh, remote shots from the field that we use on almost every newscast, of course. And uh, all kinds of interesting things. These are satellite control things that turn the dishes to whatever. I don't know. This is too technical. These are camera charts. We use these every night. And now we're getting into the production domain. Master control. This is where I sign up one day a week, Sunday nights. You know what fun I have. <laughs> this is where, this is the heart of the TV station where everything that goes over the air comes through here first. You can hear it be heart beating. There's some more satellite junk over there, on that side of the wall. These are PSAs, public service announcements. We'll keep them on the special wall. Get out of Lorraine's way, so I'm not
bring Ron Mullen down for a visit every now and then. I want to thank Gary for filming this or taping it. He's done a great job. I don't know if you can hear the music in the background, but oh, if you can't, don't worry about it. They can hear the music down in the department. Well, well I'm, I'm working, at least. Thanks, guys, uh, for all the memories, and uh, I hope I'll be here to watch it this time. Thank you very much. You can stop taping now. This is the control booth, control room, whatever you like to call it. This is the DVE. Hi, DVE. Okay, let's go for it. You ever see all those tricky moves on television? That's how they do it. This is the Grass Valley Switcher, one of the best made. So uh, that's the Chiron. And, well, that's just a branch of the Chiron. Actually, it's a very complicated machine. That that's very true. And that's the audio console where Mickey's sitting. Okay, Mickey. Not that he runs it. Okay, and around this way is the uh, it's the tele telecine. I think that's how they pronounce yeah. it. Uh, this transfers film to videotape, slides to videotape, anything you want to videotape. Scott trans this is Scott's pride and joy. Can they turn me into a video film tape? machine? Yeah, probably. Here's Blake Bryant. Hi, Rob. I've been meaning to find you. you know, that camera work on the Physical Act News is really shoddy tonight. Oh, thanks, uh, Blake. Oh, oh hello. <laughs> what, what are we doing this is here? Blake, our weekend director. Our weekday weekend director. He does what? everything, actually. What, 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 what you taping? This is, uh, these are my parents. Oh, oh. <laughs> Oh, well, that camera work was really great tonight, Rob. You Thanks, know, like. Rob is one of our finest employees. He really is. Really is. This guy's genius, though. Our, our prodigy. Proud knows our. No. Neil, Neil, would you say that? No. Hi, guys. Thanks, Blake. I appreciate that. At least the seagulls can get a quiet day's rest. <laughs> Well, that's all that's going to rest out there. <laughs> I think that's about it. I'll tell you what all those people miss out there. Uh, Rob, uh, I guess I've... Oh, I've yeah, right. Much. Some people need Doug. Okay, right. Well, that's... Let's quit this room when we get to the film. Uh, uh, that's our news tonight. Thanks for joining us. Good night. Uh, see you tomorrow. I guess I'll, I'll keep the party. And, uh, well, it's, it's 11.30. Um, i got to go now, Rob, but uh, i got to go do something. But I'll, I'll see you at the party. I'll be there, okay? I'll, I'll be there. But i, I got to do something first, but I'll be there. I'll... Rob, we really do miss you around here. It's uh, just been not the same. Uh, not the same brightness around the place. That has to do with one of the lights that's burned out right over the camera there. No, I uh, hope you're really having a good time in, uh, in Titusville. I know that... Uh, Things on the Space Coast can be a lot of fun. He is in Tampa. Tampa. Tampa? Tampa. Oh, I knew it was one of those tea towns. Well, hope you're having fun in Tampa. Uh, you got pro football there. Uh, say hi to St. Petersburg for me. And we do miss you here, and, and good luck there. Bye. 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 switcher in there, one of the best made, but uh, we don't use it, uh, we don't know why, and uh, this is where we set, sit, excuse me, and, <laughs> and this is, uh, like I said, where we sit and spend our time between shows sometimes, that's the quote of the day, 
That's the desk. And this, is, before we go in there, this is the teleprompter. This is how the, I, I think I've shown you this before. This is how uh, the anchors read the copy without having to stop or stammer, sometimes. Well, I heard they transferred you down somewhere down South Florida. Um, they said that you're uh, doing the children's channel now down there, and you put your Winnie the Pooh suit on and entertain children for an hour. But that's, hey, hey, everybody's got this fun in life. Well, I'm going to drink a beer for you, but I can't because I'm underage. So I'm going to pretend I'm drinking it. Uh, good luck, and if you ever come back, I'll still be here for two years. i got two years of school left. G-O-N-E. This week's former employee on the employee hunt list is Robert Schweitzer. He's on his way to WFLA in Tampa. He'll be one of their new camera operators. We thank you for calling Channel 17 City Line. And good luck, Rob. They'll be changed and 
shadow. 